In today's Madden 21 video, we're going to show you how to get a one play touchdown against the cover six press defense in Madden NFL 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking a look at today's video. Now, if you don't know, I have free tips every single week that I give out in my text message membership that are completely free and they're full schemes. They break down everything that you need to know about a specific playbook, maybe a specific money scheme. And in this week's video, we're going over the gun why off trips pats, um, which is one of the best schemes in the game. Now, the, the, the play I'm showing you today is from the Seahawks playbook, Gun Empty Hawk, it's inside wheels. Literally, all you have to do to beat cover six press is just call hike. And all you're gonna do here is if you get time in the pocket, you're going to be able to hit either your wheel route over the top of the defense. As you can see there, we get that nice swerve catch. Or you're also going to be able to hit uh, your post route right over the middle. So if you want to get my weekly tips, high-level Madden tips, all you got to do is just shoot me a text message. My number is 812-216-3644. But real quick, I did want to show you something else about this um, cover six press. So if you notice, you can hit the wheel route right up the seam right there, obviously. The next thing you're going to be able to do, hard left pass lead, and you're going to be able to hit that post route. So, you know, if they use her over the middle of the field, you can hit the wheel route. If they use her over the over the um, wheel route, obviously you can hit your post route. So this play is just something I was honestly messing around a little bit. It really doesn't matter. If, like, like if they shade coverage over top on this, I'll show you that this cover six stands no chance. You'll see right here, again, you're going to hit that right over the middle of that post route. You get that inside leverage. The route you really want to hit, and one little adjustment that you can do to make this play even better is you could do something like this right here where you take your tight end and put him on a smart route and out route. That's going to get this wheel route. Um, it's going to kind of mess with the matching principles a little bit. And what's going to happen from the cover six is when you put this guy on a wheel route, now part of this does certainly matter as far as what kind of press they get and all that stuff. Um, but what you'll notice here is, uh, whoops, I'm sorry, Rogers is getting a nice little throw out of sack animation, unfortunately. but what we'll show you, and I'm going to back off Shaq Barrett with that edge threat just to show you the, the routes. But I'm going to shade coverage over top. And what you'll see here is Robert Tunyon, that out route, is going to kind of mess up this match a little bit. And you'll see here, it's just going to kind of give you another window. Now, obviously, if they don't bite down on that out route, just take the out route. No big deal. Um, which you can do that, certainly. Another thing you could do with Robert Tunyon, if you wanted to, is put him on a smart routed hitch route. These smart routed hitch routes are pretty good for holding people, holding different zones and things like that. Um, but as you can see, the best route to hit, in my opinion on this, is certainly the wheel route. This is going to be cover six press. Um, now, if this was flipped, um, meaning if the cover six was flipped, then you'll see here that this left side, um, what you'll see is the, whoops, I'm sorry. I think I think I have, I think I accidentally flipped the wrong play. Um, but if I flip the defense, what you'll see is the cover six is completely flipped now, right? So you have cover four uh, on the left side. So if I flip it again, you'll see that's what we were dealing with. So like right here, now you have cover, <coughs> excuse me, cover two on one side and um, cover four on the other side. So what you'll see here on the left side is this in route right on the cut is going to be open. You're also still going to be able to work your combination um, on this back side. So let me just flip this play one more time. And I just want to show you these routes as they kind of come open. Um, now, you do have this cover four, as you see. You still have that cover four on that right side. Um, but really what you can do is playmaker up that in route right when he crosses. And as you're going to see, that's going to be a big time play for you against that cover six if it just happens to be flipped. But again, most people are going to have auto flip on. Most people are going to run this to their strong side of the field. And if they run this to the strong side of the field, this little switch concept here um, does really, really good against this cover four. or I'm sorry, this cover six. The big thing that you have to make sure that you do is you have, <coughs> excuse me, you have to make sure that you throw this wheel route at the right time. So right when that cornerback, uh, or I'm sorry, that safety comes down, that's when you want to throw it, and that's how you're going to get your one play touchdown. But this is a little tutorial on how to beat cover six. This is how you beat cover six from five wide. Um, again, you can do other things with this as well. One of my favorite hot routes to do is to take Robert Tunyon and literally just put him on a simple out route and what you'll notice is let's say this is flipped right and and everything is is like that then what you'll see is this this is going to kind of mess with some of the things and some of the principles but basically this is going to give windows for you to hit these little underneath routes as well so a lot of things you can do like i said essentially all you're trying to do is get that wheel route and post route combination so on the back side here like if we flipped it this route to Devonte adams if he was on a post right a skinny post if you have a hot route master or something this post is going to pull 
and then you're going to be able to hit that wheel right over the top as you see right there mvs over the top on the left side so you can hit it on both sides you just have to have a post that's the key um, to the routes working if he's on a dig route it won't be as open um, if he's on a slant um, you might actually have some success let me show you a slant route simple slant uh, match coverage up over top there you see there that cover two does is able to trap that wheel route in the boundary so or into the field so you just have to be kind of aware of that but just understand one of these wheel routes will pop open if they're in match coverage one of them will um, typically it's this right side um, for this play and as you can see we're going to be able to torch uh, cover six press right over the top for a one play touchdown so thank you so much for watching this video like i said um, today we have a video coming out um, that is about the gun y off trips pats um, it's going to be a full scheme from that formation it's straight out of my new england patriots offensive ebook which if you haven't gotten the new england offensive ebook you can get that in the description that is the best offensive madden in my opinion it shows you how to beat every coverage every run defense shows you how to step by step dominate your opponent in madden 21 so pick that up that link is in the description if you want this free sample all you have to do is text me my number is 812 216-3644. And here's the deal. By texting me, you don't only just get the video from this week's text membership, you get the entire playlist, which features videos um, from the Minnesota Vikings ebook. It gives you a, a playbook guide or a, I'm sorry, a, a playbook guide on the gun cluster, gives you um, a scheme out of the gun ace slot offset, the gun split close, the gun bunch, you name it, we cover it. The big nickel over G is for defense as well. So be sure to text in so you can get that video sent to you. Thanks so much for your time. We will be streaming at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern tonight.